Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Randy and we're playing some Stardew Valley. Um, I'm sorry, I'm trying to figure out the audio settings because sometimes I notice like not everything I say gets picked up. And so I'm kind of trying to figure that out. I've mentioned it in a couple other videos, so don't mind me. Um, but I'm really excited to be playing Stardew Valley. I'm just going to say this as a preface and we'll talk more about what I plan to do with this series as we go in. I don't want this intro to be long. I haven't played in years. Okay, when I got this new computer six, six or seven years ago, I can't remember if it was 2016 or 2017 I built it. I haven't played on this new computer at all. I played on my old laptop and... All I did, like, I remember I married Sebastian. And that was it. So, just in case if you're like, why doesn't she know this stuff and that stuff? It's because I haven't played in uh, God knows how long. So, let's just jump into it and I'll talk more then. I'm also using a controller so I should be louder. Oh my gosh, I, I can be a girl? I did not remember that. I'm also using a controller instead of the... Okay, that, that's legit gonna bug me. Um, I'm using just controller instead of the mouse, mainly because one, I can put my mic a little bit closer. Hopefully I'm not like spiking it too much, so I figured that'd be good. Oh my gosh, we could pick animal preference. Oh, hold on. I have to do carry. Oh god, I'm never good at this. Like, what to name my farm? I'm gonna do the thing that I did in my Animal Crossing. Um, also, I would love to do Animal Crossing for this, but I don't wanna... Yes, I am naming it after the warmongering country in Fullmetal Alchemist, Amistress. Yes, I am that much of a nerd. And, and, and let's, let's just... I don't remember... What's the favorite thing supposed to do? Uh, wait. Oh my gosh. There's so much customization now. Okay, I want like blue. That's uh, at least there we go. If you know, you know. Cry with me. Oh, dude, I want to do like red, but then we're gonna just take it down to like black. <laughs> Was that necessary? No. Oh wait. That's not an overall set! Okay, I'm- I'm sorry. This is like... That wasn't an overall set? Okay, more important- I, I don't want to make myself- okay. I'm sorry, I am like way too amused at this right now. Let's do that. That, that that's actually a really cute outfit. I actually really like that. But I, I I'm gonna make this like a little bit oop, oh, wrong one. There we go. A little bit lighter. There we go. There we go. That that that's Oh shit! I hope I didn't lose everything. Oh no, I did. Hold on, give me a second. Okay, so fun fact, I I kept messing up. This is my old farm. This is my old farm. So yeah, it's been a hot minute since I played, but yeah, let me go finish customizing and I'll be back. Okay, so this is my person. Um the the spicy if you know you know. Here's the thing. I haven't played this in so long. First of all, I think I think they did give us the option of gender. But there weren't that many choices. Second of all, there wasn't this Oh gosh. I'm nervous. There wasn't this option of farms. 
I think we were just stuck with standard. A simple plot of land with a large amount of open spaces on your farm. Um, uh, spread across several islands. I don't like that. Um, would limit your farming space. The bounty of the forest is nearby, nearly at your doorstep. Rocky terrain and winding river make it difficult to design your farm. However, mineral deposit provides mining opportunities. Plenty of good land. Four corners. Perfect for a group. Beach. Ooh. I'm stuck between beach and wilderness. I th think... Mm. I, okay, I'm gonna go with beach and uh, yeah, I'm gonna go with beach because I don't like the water. Is yeah, beach. Okay, so we have our farm, we have our person. Let's get into it. I'm sorry that took so long. <laughs> okay, once we're done with the intro, then I will explain kind of how I'm gonna go about this for my very special granddaughter. I hope this picks up. I really do. Oh. I want you to have the sealed envelope. Is that the little jub jubs? Wait, are we at his deathbed? Also, what is that at the back? Like the gold thing? Like, is that like a gold crossbow? Oh shit, it's going. Now, listen close. I skipped something. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. Oh, now you want to be slow. And your bright spirit will fade before growing emptiness. Story of my life. Oh, I, I can't control this. Oops. When that happens, my dear, you'll be ready for this gift. Can we get the sword too? And, and maybe the golden crossbow? Now, let Grandpa eternally rest. So Gramps is dead. We work in Joja? Also, why do the computers look like the 90s, like, MacBooks, like, from a distance? Was that our desk? Also, what is it with that guy with the cowboy, like, his tongue? His tongue is weird. <laughs> what dead guy! Oh my god. This was me at my old job. Yo. The struggle. Dear Randy, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. This is going to kill my voice. I've enclosed the tea to that place. My bride and joy. Hamistress Farm. Ignore the bodies. It's fine. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. Again, please ignore the bodies. It's the perfect place to start your new life. For those of you that haven't seen Full Metal Alchemist, I'm making it a reference to the war. Which, I, I, I forgot that our farm was actually located on the south. It's been this long. This was my most precious gift of all. And now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my dear. Good luck, love, Grandpa. I love how I still give him the same dying voice, but I, it's either that or I give him a hundred-year-old asthmatic. Yes, if Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? And with that, my voice is destroyed. Okay, so while we're loading, I figured I'd mention this now. Never mind, I can still talk. I don't think there's voices in this. I'm gonna try.
try to 100% this because that's what I love doing. I love 100%ing games. It's just always been kind of a thing that I personally enjoy. Um, however, like I said, I am playing vanilla. If you have any like challenge ideas or any mods that you'd like to see me do, by all means, leave them in the comments. Also, I don't know how long these episodes are going to be. I'm kind of just playing for about an hour, 30 minutes, 30 minutes to an hour, somewhere around that, and making an episode out of that. Hello, you must be Randy. I'm not going to remember this voice at all. I'm Robin, the ro local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. Why does Robin sound like a 40-year-old real estate agent? That's very weird. I'm not going to remember that voice. I just kind of threw something out. The farm's right over here. If you'll follow me. Also, is it... Wait, was Robin one of the potential love interests? Look at our little beach beach. This is Amstra's farm. Your new home. And we are screwed. Because it's been XX years. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. It's a little fixer-upper, but we're still going to make you pay for it the same amount as you would if it was brand new. With a lot of dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. Again, why am I sounding like a real estate agent? Please save me. And here we are, your new home. Oh god, I gotta do another. Ah, the new farmer. Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. That makes me very nervous about generations if not a lot of people move in we're just we're just gonna move on we're, we're just we're just gonna move on so you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage it's a good house very rustic why are you a real estate agent too i can't give you a real estate agent voice i've already picked your voice I won't remember it, but that's fine. It's a bit of a fixer-upper. Rustic, that's one way to put it. No, she sounds like a news anchor and a real estate agent combined into one. Crusty might be a little more apt, though. Yeah, she sounds more like a news anchor. Rude! <laughs> Don't listen to her, Randy. She's just trying to make you... Where did the country accent come from? <laughs> She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. I don't want him to be country. I have a different person that's going to be country. And y'all are going to regret that decision. Hmm. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. I don't even remember what voice I gave Lewis anymore. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. But I have to clean this shit mess up. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in the bo this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. Great, so we're going to have someone coming to our house in the middle of the night. Where's ADT when I need them? This is also not sponsored. At all. Okay. Gosh. There's like some things that my mic is picking up and others that aren't. And I'm like, I'm not sure what's picking up. Well, good luck. At some point I will learn how to use this thing. We'll, we'll try it. You know what? Let's do this. Let's try sticking my face nearly as close as I can to my pop filter. Because it does have some distance. Your progress has been saved. So I can move around and then check. And we got parsnip seeds in a new journal entry. You received 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. Mayor Lewis. You can't have the same voice as Gramps. Okay. Unfortunately, I 
semi remember this. So we have this skills that I don't remember. Also, this is list okay. I have to kind of reacquaint myself with this. So this this first episode is very much. How do I hold on? Okay, I have to give me a second. I have to reacquaint myself with the um, mapping of the controller. Okay, I'm not really all that acclimated with the controls, but let's get into it. Getting started. If you want to become a farmer, you have to learn, start with the basics. Use your hoe to till the soil, then use the seed packet on the tilled soil to sow a crop. Water every harvest, water every day until the crop is ready for harvest. Cultivate and harvest the parsnip. It would be a nice gesture to, in gesture to introduce yourself around town. Some people might be anxious to meet the new farmer. So we gotta go meet people and plant some parsnips. So. Oh, okay. We're gonna kinda just clear everything out. And I don't remember with the st Okay, we're gonna kinda just use this area. We're gonna start- we're gonna start small. Now, if memory serves, and I- I don't know if I'm thinking Stardew Valley or Harvest Moon, and someone's gonna tell me in the comments below, but you wanna leave this center spot open because what happens is- Oh! That's- that's a Harvest Moon thing. That's that's a Harvest Moon thing. Never mind. Here's the thing. I played more Harvest Moon in my life than I have Stardew Valley. And I played 149 out like 150 hours apparently in my last save. Okay. Oh my gosh. That's a little bit embarrassing. Um We're, we're going to go balls. We're going we're going to save like two. Okay, we're going to save one. Because I can't count. We're gonna save that one. Oop. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna save that one. Okay, let's go run around and meet some people so I can give voices that I will uh without a doubt forget. Also, I think auto runs on. I don't think I can move faster than this. Ah, oh, Mayor Lewis told me you just arrived. I'm Marnie. Marnie is our Southern Belle. Here is love interest number one. Again, I'm not picking him. Oh, I I can't talk to you. Fuck off. Okay. Oh my god, this is amazing. They give you- Did they always give you the birthdays? I feel like they did. But I don't remember. Oh, hello there. I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Star Drop Saloon. How much is a backpack upgrade? 2000 We ain't got no money. Okay. I don't want to do the constantly reproducing. Actually, I'm going to get one. Oh my god, I forgot. I have, like, no room. For, like, anything. I don't know what's the most... Like, the smartest thing to buy. Chance of... I'm gonna buy a couple collies. Okay. Okay, we can't meet any. Wait, what? There was a box of something down here. What the fuck was the box? Sorry, I've never seen this. It, it, is that supposed to be like a co op thing that I like throw my shit in? I really don't know. I have no clue. Ha 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 ha! 
Oh wait, no, I'm not using Kip. I'm not doing that yet. I'm not doing. I'm not for Alex. Hey, you're the new girl, huh? I think we're gonna get along great. I'm Alex. This is our. Jim is the only like. My only characteristic. Hey, kid. Name's Pam. Okay, we're gonna kind of like introduce ourselves to like as many people as we can throughout like the first good chunk of the day. Oh god, I forgot there was another old couple. Which means I have to pull out that voice. Why, hello and welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny if you like. I, I'm, I'm gonna get away from the mic when I do this one. Apologies. <clears throat> it's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? said like new people didn't show up that often name's george by the way a buzz off hmm. that 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 was not as loud as i thought it was gonna be it's it's fine memory serves some of these trash cans you can like check for stuff we're gonna make this episode a little bit longer mainly because i can and we have a i forgot we have a full inventory already i don't think we could check out here Oh, oh shit! Hold on, I might have, I might have fucked up. <laughs> hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. He has Rengoku vibes, and part of me wants to say spoilers. I does he live? Does he die? There's no one in this house. We're breaking. Oh, hold on. What is this? Pelican Tail marriage log. After marriage, you may file for divorce here. Lost and found. Ledger box. You can file for divorce here? Okay, so here's the plan. Here's the plan. This is what I'm thinking. What I want to do is I want to be a hoe in this game. I, I am going to eventually choose Sebastian in the end. Because my heart and soul belongs to him. And I really don't think there's anyone else that I would prefer than Sebastian. Tips on farming. Use a fertilizer. Fruit trees take a whole season to grow, but they require very little maintenance. Keep the air directly around it. Keep the area directly around your new sapling. Clear or else it may not grow properly. Crops will die as soon as the season ends unless they grow in multiple seasons like corn. Some crops such as kale and wheat need to be harvested with the scythe. Okay, so those books are going to show up every once in a while, and that's going to be helpful. This is the museum. and Okay, so that, that's all the museum. Okay. But we have nothing in there because we have nothing. And also, like, we have little to no room in our goddamn inventory for anything. Well, hello. Welcome to the Stardew Archaeology Office. Uh, this is embarrassing. But the previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for display. But I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? I, I don't know what voice that was for Gunther. Okay, once it hits, like, 3 p.m., we're going to stop introducing ourselves to everyone. I'm, I'm I'm trying not to pay attention to, like, the stuff where it's like, oh, okay, this person is out at this time. This person's out at this time. And st oh, wait. I, I, they're... I'll come back down here later. Because everyone else is, like, north of this. Look at all the dead bodies. Okay, we've already talked to Evelyn. We've already given her a voice. I want to try to at least give most everyone voices. This episode, I really should come in with these with, like, voices in mind, like, objectives in mind, but I'm kind of, like, playing a little bit loosey-goosey right now, because I don't remember. Oh! I can read it on your face! You're gonna love it here in Pelican Town! If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work! So it's Emily. I don't remember anything about her. Oh, a stranger! My name's Vincent! Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. This is a town of like 20 people. You know everyone. Okay. Also, it's funny that you can like literally just break into people's houses. With like no repercussions whatsoever. Like, I know it's like the rooms are a different story and that's based off of like friendship level, but I thought at one point it was 
Wasn't that? I don't... Oh, gosh. More voices. Oh, aren't you exactly how I imagined? But that's okay. I'm Jody. <laughs> Hello. You must be Randy, the new farmer. I'm Caroline. I'm not going to remember any of these voices. And there's a good chance I will eventually give up on all of these voices. Be prepared for that. These voices won't be consistent, but we'll give it a shot. Okay, it's 3 p.m. now. I'm going to kind of just do a little bit of stuff. So I think some of these trees... Okay, let's check out the community center first. I remember the community center because this was a bitch. Oh, it's locked. Never mind. Fuck you. Let's do that. I don't remember what the fiber does. I also kind of want to be a little bit of a hoarder. Wait, was there... There's a, there's a cap, is it? There's not a cap. Suck it. I don't remember there being a little playground. Wait, are those trees just decoration? All this shit's decoration. Nothing's on these trees. I know that's a flower I can pick, but I, I have no room for it. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. I don't have any bodies in my basement. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, let's go back home. Because... Here's the thing. I don't remember. Like, I know what, like, what the point of the game is for the most part. But I'm kind of just like... I don't know. It's hard to put those in the ground. Oh, the seed changes color. Okay, so... Okay, so right now we're going to have, like, the ugliest, like, garden patch ever. But that's going to be fine. And we're like multi like we're drowning some of these plants. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, we're kind of just gonna work the rest of the time. Can I take these trees down? Yes, I can. I don't know what I need to hang on to. I'm going to be honest. I want to also get all this fiber up, mainly because once this stuff starts growing, I can't, I'm going to have to be very careful with my scythe. Oh, I need to plant my, my bean. Where's my bean? God damn. I don't... Someone's gonna tell me in the comments that that was a dumb decision. I, 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 I wouldn't put it past myself. Oh, there's my scythe. Because I also do remember that you get, like, the level ups and stuff. And, like, my scythe and all of that, hold on. Let me check mixed seeds. I don't remember with these. There's a little bit of everything here. Plant them and see what. Okay, so these are like gotcha seeds. Okay. I'm gonna kind of work late into the night, mainly because one, we still have energy. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna constantly forget what buttons are what. So when I do stupid shit, one, it, there's a good chance it's because I'm an idiot. But two, it might also be because I'm, like, hitting the wrong buttons. Okay. Um, what do I want to sell? I'm gonna right now get rid of all of this stuff. This, the, I will come to regret that later. But right now, the main reason I want to get rid of all that is because we don't have a lot of room for storage. 
Yeah, I think this is just going to be a long first episode because I do want to get, like, quite a bit of stuff done. And don't worry, like, for the most part, this one's not going to be cut down at all. Um, reason being is I kind of want to just do as, like, much as I can and kind of just intro all of this. Also, this is only going to be going up twice a week, so... But I am going to be pre-filming a bit... So if you're like, hey, you should do this, by all means, always leave any comments if I'm, like, fucking stuff up, because there's a good chance I will. Um, it Just depending on how I'm doing in terms of, like, my schedule, because I might just have time where I can pre-film a bunch, but I'm, I'm, I'm not going to try to get too, too crazy. Um, because I also have a bunch of other shit going on, so it's not like I can be like, ha ha ha, I'm going to film like all of this at once. This isn't going to be like other LPs that I'm going to do where most of the time I am going to film like a hundred percent, like all of it. But I am going to say that I will get quite a bit, um, mainly just I kind of want to prioritize getting these videos out every Saturday and Sunday because that's going to be the schedule. Every Saturday and Sunday is going to be more Stardew Valley or whatever, like, ongoing series. Okay, I want to keep going. Oh, we got coal. Um, and then eventually, like I said, once I kind of like 100% vanilla, if there's any mods or anything, I don't mind going back through and those will probably be more edited. Or if there's like challenge ones that you're like, oh, you should do like this challenge because I've seen like some, like, I guess Stardew Valley creators, my axe isn't good enough. I think I could just let that grow. Mainly because I also don't know, like... And of course, my setup, um, I have a bunch of, like, anime figurines on my desk. And, of course, like, my Dobby figurine is, like, right in the corner where I, like, can't see. I'm going to keep going a little bit more. Okay. That should be good. I'm going to get rid of all the fiber. And we're going to plant this one mixed seed. Okay, now we're going to go to bed. Yes, go to sleep for the night. Okay. Oh, this is... I, I love this because I, and I can kind of, like, see, like... Oh, okay, this is how much I make from this. Okay. We made, like, $150... Like, $1.57. I, I'm equating the G to Yen... Oh, I forgot. Um, okay, it's going to rain tomorrow. Uh, luck will not be on my side. Luck is never on my side. D join the club. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's general store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. Hello there, I just got back from... I don't remember, Willie. Um, you should come down to the beach. I got something for you, Willie. Okay. First and foremost. Now, the thing is... Oh! No, that's crafting. Wasn't there... Oh, God, this, 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 was, this was a mistake to find. My stupid ass, like, completionist is going to hate me for finding this. Oh my god! There's a collection for that, too? Okay, here's the thing. Wasn't there something where I could, like, tell... Oh my god, am I thinking Harvest Moon again? Where it was, like, at a certain point, it's like, oh, you're, um, you can, like, level up your item. Is that what I'm thinking? 
can I just, when I have the materials and the money, I can level up my equipment. W was that what it is in this game? Okay. Um, we're going to do a little bit. We're going to get some of these trees. Mainly because they also kind of obstruct everything, but I'm, I'm also not too concerned with, like, everything there. I want to go forage. Because we need to go down to the beach. I'm also putting everything... These do something, and I don't remember what they do. <gasps> Hold on. I'm curious. Oh, okay, so, wait. I think this game saves every day. What is this, like, the hard... Wait. Oh my gosh, I, I have a separate area. Okay, today is going to be, like, a kind of exploring day. Okay, I have a fish area. Okay, so this is all my farm, right? Okay, so I can also farm on the... Here's the thing. I'm not going to make a super, super big farm, mainly because I don't think there's any way to, like, automate it. And the reason I say that is because I really, like, if I end up taking, like, so much time to, like, spend on, like, the farm, then I can't do the other stuff, like, out of order. Okay, the bus is out of service, and I think that has to do with the, um community center also was there like health okay didn't the health bar eventually like move up why why is that yelling at me oh someone named willie has in invited you to visit them at the beach um visit the beach south of town before five okay let's go down there now because i will forget Uh, another annoying voice incoming. Uh, hi. How many more villagers do we have to introduce ourselves to? Well, and, and I'm just going to be honest. Willie's going to get the most normal voice in this whole goddamn game. I, I'm, I'm already, like, struggling with more voices. And I'm like, oh, no. Ahoy there, miss. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet ya. That is a terrible pirate impression. Oy vey. Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty sea. It was a big haul. Sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the old art of, the art of fishing stays alive. And hey. Maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Da -da -da -da! You received a bamboo pole. Oh, there's more. There's good water here in the valley. All kind of fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's what my old pappies used to say anyway. Why does my head look square? Yeah, this is going to be like a very unedited episode. So apologies. Let's see. We've. Oh, this shows if we've talked to them today. That's. And this also shows like who we haven't talked to. That's interesting. 
So we still have a few people we need to introduce ourselves to, in including our future husband. Okay, so he has... Because I think if memory serves, the fishing poles, like, you can lose them? I think? I don't remember. Oh, fuck. I did not throw that out far enough. Here we go. I haven't fished in this game in God knows how long. Wait! Oh! And I think if memory serves, it gets easier to catch fish. Because, like, you're able to, like, level up your pole. No. Oh. Thought I could put it in the box. I can't put it in the box. It's fine. Oh, I should have got the, like, conch shells. It's, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, so we actually might not be able to meet all the villagers this episode, but that's okay. It gives me a little bit of time to figure out future voices. Am I think still full? Um, red mushroom. I'm not I'm gonna ignore that because I don't know where those are. And I don't think I ever crossed the Now I Welcome to Joja Mart. How are you doing today? I don't believe we've met. I'm Morris, Joja Customer Satisfaction Representative. When you decide to become a Joja member, I'll be delighted to make your transition a joyous experience. 20, on, um, 25.75. I'm keeping those numbers in mind because I'm going to look at Pierre's numbers and see if they're different. Hey, don't be snooping around the trailer when I'm out. Got it? I just talked to you. The beach is a cool place to hang out and soak up some rays. Why did he turn into a surfer? Okay, so here's the thing. Pierre's prices are actually cheaper. So how's your first night at the Gold Cottage? Oh, that's right. I heard someone new was moving onto that old farm. That was not the voice I wanted to give Abigail. But that's the voice I gave Abigail. No offense to you, but fuck you, Abigail. Okay. I do want to search for some more villagers. And and I know they're... I don't know if they're technically called villagers, but I'm going to call them villagers. Oh, here's Clint. Oh. Oh, okay, so I can upgrade any time. Awesome. Er, I, uh, I'm Clint. And now we've met Clint. Okay, that becomes important late. I think we get that later. Okay, so I do know I'm going to take the path of getting rid of Joja. I don't know where I'm going. There's not a map in this game, is there? There is a map. Okay. Oh! That's where Sebastian lives. It's above the community market. We need to at least meet the future husband. I haven't given him a voice yet. I, I'm very tempted on giving him a head empty one like Kurokiba from Food Wars. Um, we're, we're just we're just gonna move on from there. Yeah. 
<laughs> Greetings, I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. Yeah, these voices are going to get more generic as we go. <laughs> Sebastian! There he is. Our local nerd. He's going to stay in his room most of the time. It's fine. It's as close as we'll probably get today. I don't have any, like, tracking information on him yet, so... I can't tell you where he's at most of the time. It'll probably be a while before we end up, like, you know... Giddy kids to fall in love with us. <laughs> Stranger. Hello. Okay. Who else do we need to technically meet? Okay. One, two, three, four. Da. Okay. I don't remember where like 80% of these people live. Which can prove problematic. Am I supposed to like catch that bird? Because that, that's like a not generic colored bird also i don't remember if we have like a chest or something i need a shit ton of wood yay okay i don't know when slash if we can go in I, I know we could go in at some point but i don't know when we can go into the community center I apologize again. Oh, you're the new farmer girl or whatever, aren't you? I do want to play the whole game. Because I want to try to get every character up to 10 hearts. So I am playing the whole game. I don't remember what Ashley likes, so. <gasps> For me? Thank you. Her name's Haley, not Ashley. I fucked that up. Oh, we can get a hat at some point in life. I want these people to like me. Then I can become the new cult leader. You gotta spend some time in the sun or else you'll get all pale. I work part time at Gus's saloon. It pays the bills. Oh, hold on. I forgot. I'm the host slash cult leader. You did good with this one, kid. Thanks. I. That, that's fine. What can I get for you? Okay, also, you can get stuff out of these. I'm, I might try to, like, record attempts every once in a while. I think I might do that, like, at the end. Hold on. Oh my gosh, I forgot. We can also get recipes for stuff. I I, I will be 100% honest. I will be a mega food whore in this game. Lux, make yourself comfortable. Okay, we've talked to all of y'all for the day. It's also like 6 p.m. I haven't talked to... <laughs> what? What do you want? Go away. Can I take that Joja Cola and shove it up your ass? We have been here two days and I already want to fight someone. That, that's on par with me. That really is. Okay, that's Haley's house. Oh yeah, because she's the um, market's daughter. I can't make a preacher's daughter joke. I need to talk to this brat. Mom won't let me have any more gummies today. How many bags have you ate, kid? Okay. Thanks! This looks nice! Oh, hello! I'm Penny! Oh, this is... This is the, um... farm place I have no room for like anything else 9 to 6 where am I at I 
I'm gonna do this way too much. Okay, we're gonna go over to the wizard's tower. Uh, wizard's tower's down here. I don't know if he has office hours. Have we talked to you before? <gasps> Hello, it's so nice to meet you. No, we have it. This is a really nice gift. Thank you. Okay, let's get more flowers so that we can be instilled as the cult leader of this place. Okay. Oof. Okay. So. Gosh. My brain is now trying to think because I was like, there were things that I was going to say at the beginning of this series. That I was like, oh, okay, like, once we get into the gameplay. Oh, yeah. Um, basically, what I think I'm going to do with these episodes is take about an hour, hour and a half. I think I mentioned this. Like, film time. And then just edit it down to so it's, like, kind of just the nitty gritties. This one I'm not going to. I'm just going to let it be the full hour. Mainly because it is the beginning and it feels like kind of a lot of the stuff is fairly pertinent. Yeah, we did water everything, so I don't have to worry about that. Um, and also, too, another thing, I just... I, I know that these are going to be, like, long episodes. Like, they might be long, they might be short. But I figured that way, like, because I'm thinking in my mind... If I sit here and kind of just edit it down. Also, like I said, I am going to try to 100% and then we'll move on to a different kind of never-ending game like this. I do have a few in mind, so if you have any suggestions, also, like, please let me know. Um, this will be updated on the weekend, so Saturday, Sunday. And like I said, and also I haven't played this game in years, so it's... There are probably quite a few things that I'm forgetting or getting, for some reason, confused with Stardew Valley. That, that for some reason, has just been a thing. Um, which is fine. Like, um, oh gosh. I feel like I'm forgetting something. And it's... I think that's everything. Um. Yeah, because I'm not going to be, like... I'm not going to try to do too much in advance in terms of, like, pre-filming, but I do prefer pre-filming, mainly because it keeps me kind of in line, and it's like, oh, okay, I know where I'm at. But I'm also kind of thinking, like, these first days, because it's a lot of clearing out the farm, meeting all these people, because, like, once I hit, like, ten stars with people, more than likely I'm going to probably just start ignoring them. They've served their purpose in the cults. You know, I don't need them. But, we shall see. Ooh, I am going to build. Yeah, we're going to throw that wood away. I don't know where I want to put this chest right now. So we're going to put it right over here. Mainly, I just want something that's going to have, like, a shit ton of... We don't have a sword. Yeah. Okay, so I think we're going to call it a day there at the end of day two. I know that this was a fairly long episode. Thank you guys for sticking around. Hopefully, next episode won't be as long and I'll be able to kind of do a little bit more. But I figured kind of just to show around all of that. Anyways, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Let me get in bed. That might be something that works. Ooh, we got foraging. So our ax is more proficient and sometimes it drops seeds. And we got two new crafting recipes. Awesome. Okay. <laughs> I'll see y'all tomorrow for a new Stardew Valley episode. Bye.
Thank you.